You, you're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush, same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, I could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there, you and me, we shouldn't be here. It's these Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in vines now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl Windhelm? You're the leader of the Rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella, Kinnereff, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. Used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Elod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny, when I was a boy, imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so sick. Keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We weren't with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Trail off of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No! I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you?
You picked a bad time to come on to Skyrim, Kinsman. Captain, what should we do? She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least you'll die here, in your homeland. Follow the Captain, prisoner. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, run Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the eight divines upon For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over with. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? Prisoner, nice and easy. What in oblivion is that? Sentries, what do you see? It's in the clouds. if you want to stay that way. Gunnar, take care of the boy. I have to find General Tolias and join the defense. Gods guide you, Hadvar. Stay close to the wall! Really 
a dragon. Bring us of the end times. We should keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. Take a look around. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. I'm going to see if I can find something for these worms. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. Look around. Then this way. Said at how I've been entertaining their comrades. Do you even know what's going on? A dragon is attacking Helgen. A dragon? Please, don't make up nonsense. Although, come to think of it, I did hear some odd noises coming from over there. Come with us. We need to get out of here. You have no authority over me, boy. Didn't you hear me? I said the keep is under attack. Forget the old man. I'll come with you. Wait a second. 
Looks like there's something in this cage. Don't bother with that. Lost the key ages ago. Poor fellow screamed for weeks. See if you can get it open with some picks. We'll need everything we can get. Sure. Take all my things. Please. Grab what you can. are we supposed to go? Where's the way out? Just give me a minute. Let me think. Put the glory of the Empire! Oh. You're no. We are routed. <laughs> Let's see where this goes. I guess we're lucky that didn't come down on top of us. We'd better push on. I'm sure the others will find another way out. Ah, uh, that 
doesn't go anywhere. I guess we'd better try this way. snakes. There's a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. You might be able to sneak by. Just take it nice and slow and watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this bow. This looks like the way out. I was starting to wonder if we'd ever make it. Like he's gone for good this time. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. The closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. But you didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. Oh, right. You were caught trying to cross the board. You're not kidding. Ulfric's the leader of the Stormcloaks. You, you haven't heard of the Civil War in Skyrim? I guess down in the Cyrodiil, people have other things to worry about. It's pretty simple. 
Ulfric founded the Stormcloaks years ago, as a sort of private army to advance his ambitions. He's always used the ban on the worship of Talos to stir people up against the Empire. He never succeeded in getting much support, so a few months ago he murdered the High King. <laughs> got the Empire's attention. A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the general turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. He surrendered pretty meekly too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the general changed his mind. You know the rest. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence that the first dragon anyone seen for centuries attacks just as Ulfric was about to be executed. Of course. I know today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon... General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. No, not yet. After all, a dragon, something out of old tales and legends. No one could have expected that. But you can bet he'll be trying to figure it out. This could shift the whole balance of the war. If you want to help stop that dragon, your best bet is to go to Solitude and join up with the Legion. I hope so. The Legion is Skyrim's only hope right now. Come on, we better get moving. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. And if the Rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself. Well, to each his own, it's nothing. 
Listen, as far as I'm concerned, you've already earned your call. But until we get that confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers and avoid any complications, all right? This is still flying around there somewhere. We'd better keep moving. I feel like that dragon might be up there walking. To you, boy. Shh, Are you in Uncle, some kind please. of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? She's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. A dragon! Be careful! What? What is it now, mother? was as big as the mountain and black as night. It, it flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Please, Muff. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. And I've got better things to do than this in the war with the magazines. You'll see. It was a dragon. Sigrid, we have company. We've been so worried about you. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy. What's the big mystery? What are you doing here looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tullius' guard. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. A dragon? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk. Hey, Why, you husband, little filcher? Let him tell his story. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to Solitude and let them know what's happened. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. Needs to know there. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt.
cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. When you get to Whiterun, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Jarl Balgraf? He rules Whiterun Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Elisif much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. Of course, Skyrim has always been part of the Empire. That doesn't mean I support everything the Empire's been doing lately. But Nords have never been fair-weather friends. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will imp... If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torik when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torik, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death, if you believe the stories. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Yaros start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Good Hi, day. Can you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Hush, well, I don't trust your cousin. You two make yourselves at home. friendly with strangers, but you... Ouch! Hey! My father is Alvor, the blacksmith. Someday, I'm going to forge my own sword. 